Okay, so we're back with the second part of the Treasures of the Past DLC. Uh, so right now, this is probably the easiest chest to get, and it actually does not take a lockpick. It is open, uh, and I'm going to show you what you can get out of it. As you see, we're at Scallets, which is, of course, the original place where we started, where everything went crazy. Let me zoom in, well, zoom in a little bit more and show you kind of where we're at. Uh, just right over this bridge, right outside the main gate, um, there is this little bridge right here. And be careful because at the beginning of the game, there's still humans around that will come and attack you. But, again, you see where that's located at? Again, I'll show you again on the map. Right, right here, right at the edge of this bridge. And what you do, you just walk down here and look at that chest just sitting there. Open it up and look at all that good stuff in there. Uh, you've got the Bailiff's Mace, which is one of the best weapons in the game. 288 Groshen, um, a metal plate battle axe, 1.3 thousand Groshen, a necklace, a silver ring. And that's all free for the taking, so go ahead and take it all and there you go. And... That is part two of the Treasures of the Past DLC. Make sure you subscribe. We've got more coming up and uh, going to show you a lot more really cool things in Kingdom Come Deliverance.